Okay. Today the topic is uh, inter-company billing process. We have two company codes, one in France, 2200, one in Germany, 1000. So the same global company has got two legal entities, one in Germany, one in France. In France, the customer is going to go to buy the product. But if that product is not available in France, they're going to get that product from a plant in Frankfurt, Germany, which is 1200. As a result, what happens is, once you bill the customer in France, you are going to get the money, but you don't keep all that money. You got to give some money back to the Germany company because that's where you took the product. This is called inter-company sales process. Okay, so let's get started. Create a sales order. Use VA01. Type VA01. Enter. That's all good. Hit enter. Your customer is 2500. Sold to party is 2500. 2500. And ship to party 2500. And the material all the way down you have a material. The product is 78. Three zero, and the quantity is three quantity, and the plant, the Frankfurt plant in Germany is giving you the product. Twelve hundred is the Frankfurt product. That is twelve hundred in Frankfurt, Germany. Okay, go ahead and hit enter. Wonderful. And let's take a look at the shipping. So we need to know when to ship it. The shipping is going to happen on 18th November. And the shipping point is 1200. And you see the sold to party description that's in France. You see that English? That's not English. Okay. Wonderful. Okay. Now go ahead and save it. Very good. So let's create a delivery slash n vl 01n slash n. You need to put slash n because it's not SAP easy access. VL01n. Okay. Wonderful. 18th is correct date, 1200 is the shipping point, that's all good. Hit enter and click on picking, yeah you are in picking and uh, take a note of the lean warehouse which is 012 and the storage location is 001, the picking did not happen, it's uh, right now picked quantity is 0, the moment you save it it's going to pick it up automatically behind the screen. Go ahead and save it. Wonderful. So let's go to change delivery and top menu. You click on top menu right here. You click here. You can see the change right there. Click on that. That's your document. Click on document flow. I want to see what's going on. You see that? Warehouse management transfer order 5800 is already completed. Wonderful. Go back, back arrow, and uh, hit enter. Enter post goods issue. Very good. 
And if you go and take a look at your stock right here, and 93 is going to be 90. You see that? So stock is gone. Now let's go back here and now create a billing document slash n v f enter hit enter enter you see customer billing is f2 how much you are get how much you are getting from the customer 3600 go ahead and save it okay and um, you need to do one more time so your uh, document is 32 right and this time go and pick intercompany building right here go and pick intercompany i and they are all in alphabetical order Now, yeah, that's the one. Enter. So you are not getting that 3,600. You see that? It's only 2,400. And that means 3,600 minus 2,400 is your profit. And this is going to go to intercompany. That means it goes to Germany company. Because you got the product from there. You go ahead and save it. Okay, now take me to display sales order. Sales order display. Click on document flow. You see that? You created a standard order, outbound delivery, transfer order, warehouse management transfer order goods issued to the customer, customer billing F2, enter company billing IV. Wonderful. Okay. So now what, what I want to do is I will uh, change the presenter.